Hey, what is going on, party people? I have got some big news for you. Well, potentially big news, depending on who you are. Um, but it's news, nonetheless, if you are an Infusionsoft user. So if you were at PartnerCon or at Icon a few months ago, you may have heard some rumblings about Keep Max um, or Keep Max Classic. Uh, and I wanted to clarify uh, exactly what those are and what this might mean to you as an Infusionsoft user. So Okay, so the long and the short of it is that uh, Infusionsoft is being renamed. So the new name for Infusionsoft as we know it will be Keep Max Classic. Um, but I point, I, I, I know this is going to get a little bit complicated, so, so hang with me as I give you a little bit of a history lesson here, right? So at the start of 2019, Infusionsoft, the company, renamed to Keep. At that point, they had two softwares they offered, uh, Keep, which was uh, formerly known as New Infusionsoft. If you remember, it had like some purple branding for a little while there. Um, so they offered Keep and also Infusionsoft. And then they have evolved now and Keep split into two different platforms known as Keep Grow and Keep Pro. Um, and then the, the, the premium software is Infusionsoft, the most robust version of their, of their platform there. Um, uh, but what a lot of people don't know is that the Infusionsoft platform actually also has a, um, a new interface that you can access um, if you contact support and you ask them to enable like a little toggle. It's not exactly identical. There are some features on that new interface that aren't available on the classic Infusionsoft platform, and there are some features on the Infusionsoft classic platform that you lose if you switch to that new interface. So the new interface was called, or has been called, um, Infusionsoft on the Keep experience because it's kind of got a modern look and feel like the Keep platform does. Um, and I know that's a bit of a mouthful, but the reason I highlight that is because that Infusionsoft on the Keep experience version of the software is going to be called Keep Max. And then Infusionsoft, which we, you know, know and love and most of us use, is going to be called Keep Max Classic. So, uh, the product lineup that Keep, the company, offers will be Keep Grow, which is actually changing names to Keep Light, um, but that's not really super important for this video. Keep Grow, Keep Pro, and then in the, you know, the premium category, they will have Keep Max and Keep Max Classic. Now, um, I know that the word classic doesn't exactly inspire a whole lot of confidence, um, but I have been told uh, I've checked and double checked. I have been told that we should think of it more like classic Coke and not like classic car. So a, a timeless favorite and not a, um, a discontinued model. Um, so hopefully this gives you some context for what those um, platforms will be, what the name change might entail. Um, and if you are an Infusionsoft user, this really might not affect you. It is just a name change. We will still continue to access the same software through the same links, the same um, interface, the same features, and it will still enjoy the same attention and focus it has gotten. Um, and the, the updates will continue to roll out at the same cadence that they have been. Um, but if you are an Infusionsoft partner or a service provider who services Infusionsoft users, uh, you're going to want to be aware of this name change so that you can update your uh, different products or services or offerings on your website to reflect that. Um, if you are a content producer like me and you have a blog or a YouTube channel or, or a you know, progression path of courses, um, obviously, you know, there's a, a fair amount of work to do to make those as re uh, current as possible and to reflect the new naming conventions. But um, I wanted to do this quick video just to let you know Infusionsoft, the software, is getting a new name, um, Keep Max Classic, uh, with the, the, the broader vision of having a more cohesive um, suite of products in the Keep family, having more obvious alignment between those products. Um, and I think this this probably makes a lot of sense for the company. It, um, you know, it doesn't really change things for us as the current user base, but for all new users who are signing up, for everyone who signs up in the future, hopefully this will make it easier for them to understand the different options, to see the connection. Um, whereas in the past, I think having two products named Keep Grow and Keep Pro and having a third one named Infusionsoft probably caused some, some unnecessary confusion for people in terms of choosing the right platform for them. So that is it for now. If you have questions about this, uh, please feel free to post them in the comments below.